But how about some puppies? A homeless man in Vancouver was told his dog could not get pregnant and then send seven puppies were born. He was instantly overwhelmed, as you could imagine. He didn't know how he'd give them even basic medical care until the Humane Society came and stepped in for help. Here's Devin Haskins with his story. So just grab three. Doc Kerr has his hands full, to say the least. That is a special little girl. With not one. Come on, Jebney. Get in there, Jebby. But seven. There you go. His dog Harley gave birth to seven puppies that currently live with him in a small temporary home at Vancouver's Safe Stay community. This community for the homeless just opened in December. Here, residents are provided with resources to find permanent housing. That's why I stayed in the old camp. Resources are not so easy. <laughs> Besides grabbing his heart. Who couldn't like that little cute face? His pups also can be a little overwhelming, especially since he wasn't expecting them. I was told she was fixed. Yeah, she even has a little scar down there. Four pounds, 13 ounces. So to help ease some of that burden. Let's get a picture real quick. The Humane Society for Southwest Washington is helping Doc out. Doc is a member of our community and he is overwhelmed and needed help. And so we're the Humane Society for Southwest Washington. So we want to support pets and their people. One by one. Okay, Amber, 6.3. At just four weeks old. Look at it. Each puppy getting a checkup. I just need her Bordetella. Some dewormer and then a vaccine. There we go. Among the puppies. Do we have any boys? Six girls and a boy. That's mini Sambor in the corner. And that's, that one right there is Junko. With the special one, he named Miracle. Because she's a miracle, she's alive. Harley had her out there in the grass, I didn't know it. The puppies won't stay with Doc for long. In just a few weeks, the Humane Society will give them their second dose of these shots and then soon adopt them out. Yeah, so it's going to turn out that we'll get seven puppies homes and that the mom and dad will be altered and vaccinated. So it's a really a win-win for everybody. But like a lot of things we grow close to, Doc says it won't be easy to let these faces go. I love them. They're going to be, I'm going to be a crankpot that day probably. I wish I still had my, my house. The Humane Society said this was most likely a first, if not a very rare thing they did for Doc and his puppies. They would do this more if they hear about a litter being born in a similar situation. Now these puppies, they should be available for adoption in Washington, most likely within the next two months. I'm Devin Haskins, KGW News.